Hey everyone, and welcome to another episode of Mikey Reacts. Uh, today, <clears throat> so I've been requested a couple of times, uh, Arlington by Trace Atkins. Um, so I've never heard the song. I can only imagine by its name what it's about. Um, I know that Arlington's a U.S. National Cemetery located in is Virginia, right? Um, so I've never been, and I, I've always wanted to go. There's a lot of heroes buried there. This is just my speculation, so we'll get to the video in just a second. Please like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment of your recommendations down below, or anything you want me to watch. It doesn't have to be music related, it can be anything. I will get to it, I promise. So, um, yeah, like I said, that's just speculation. So let's actually get to the video. Let's see what it's about, and uh, hopefully, if it's sad, um, I won't cry on camera too much. I never thought that this is where I'd settle down Thought I'd die an old man back in my hometown They gave me this plot of land Me and some other men For a job well done There's a big white house sits on a hill just up the road The man inside he cried the day they brought me home They folded up a flag Told my mom and dad We're proud of your son And I'm proud to be on this peaceful piece of property I'm on sacred ground and I'm in the best of company I'm thankful for those, thankful for the things I've done I can rest in peace I'm one of the chosen ones I made it to Arlington I remember daddy brought me here when I was eight We searched all day to find out where my granddad lay And when we finally found that cross He said, son, this is what it costs To keep us free here I am a thousand stones away from him He recognized me on the first day I came in And it gave me a chill When he clicked his heels and saluted me And I'm proud to be on this peaceful piece of property I'm on sacred ground and I'm in the best of company And I'm thankful for those, thankful for the things I've done I can rest in peace, I'm one of the chosen ones I made it to Arlington And every time I hear 21 I know they brought another hero home to us. We're thankful for those, thankful for the things we've done. And we can rest in peace. We are the chosen ones We made it to Arlington Yeah, dust to dust Don't cry for us We made it to Arlington
God bless the man that wrote that song and those who lay there in Arlington. Speechless. That got me. That really got me. Yeah, so I was right. I mean, that was, that is a deeply emotional song. I was right. So it was about, obviously, Arlington National Cemetery and um, the heroes that, that lay there and um, the story of, obviously, this soldier um, coming through and uh, having, obviously, passed away, given his life in the line of his duty, you know, so um, there's really no greater gift a man can give than to lay down his life for his loved ones, I believe, and for his freedom and and uh, the things that he believes in. And these people, these soldiers, these brave men and women have done so in the hundreds of thousands over many years have whilst fighting for a cause they believe in. And it's just... It's saddening and beautiful at the same time. And when I say beautiful, I don't mean that in a sick sense. I mean that in that someone will have such love in their heart for something they believe in, such conviction that they will be willing and ready to give their life for that is a beautiful trait in humans. Um, war, like they say, shows the most beautiful aspects of humanity and also the most horrendous. Um, and I believe these soldiers that lay there at Arlington display the most beautiful and honourable and courageous aspects of any of any corner, of any corner of the world, of any, hu of, of any race of people, of the human race. Um, so that was a deeply emotional song. That, did, that really did get to me because... Unfortunately, you know, I, I have known some people that have, have gone that way and God bless them, obviously not in the United States, but in the British Army. And, and uh, so, yeah, that is a very emotional song. Uh, for me, what got me especially was the moment where he said that, um, was it his grandfather? He saw his grandfather and his grandfather clicked his heels and saluted him as if to say, welcome home, son, you know, welcome home, son. And that is um, whether you whether or not you believe in the afterlife or not. I know for one, for a fact, I'm religious, so so I do, and so that is that is extremely beautiful um, to make it home. And of course, they always say never cry for the they never weep for the dead. I, I think it's the the families who suffer the most. Um, and I know in the United States there are organizations, uh, charities who do look after families of fallen soldiers. And that is also a beautiful cause, something very, very nice that people do. And it shows a great sense of community and patriotism that people will go out of their way, out of their daily working lives to do that for somebody else that they've never even met because their family member gave the ultimate sacrifice for the Stars and Stripes, for God, for country, and for the people who live in it, and ultimately their freedoms and their liberties. Um, and the, obviously the United States Constitution, which guarantees all of those. So there is so much in this song that can be unpacked. Um, on the musical side, he has an absolutely beautiful, deep, deep voice. That was the first thing that caught my ears was his deep voice. And for me, he's the perfect, of course it's his song, but it's the, he's the perfect man to sing this song because he has... That, that the, the depth in his voice uh, really creates the, the atmosphere, the ambiance for the song. Um, and I think, you know, his, the, the lyrics and, and what the song talks about and the somberness in his voice, really, um, they match together. And that is what makes him, I think, a great artist. Now, this is actually maybe the second song of his that I've ever listened to and the first that I've reacted to. So I've still got a lot more to learn about Trace Atkins and, and what he's about. But, you know, seeing him in the video, having gone to Arlington, having gone to the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, that is, um, it shows, again, deep respect. And I know, of course, it was done for video purposes, but I have 
no reservations in saying that most likely that was a deeply emotional experience for him as well. Otherwise, he probably would not have produced a song. So I, he, he must be deeply patriotic and respectful of those men and women who have passed away. And, you know, I want to reiterate that this, you know, Arlington is not just for those who have fallen in the first, second world wars or even in the civil war or wars before and wars after or Vietnam. This is for people that have passed away recently fighting for our freedoms over in the Middle East. So I want to say a special thank you to those men and women and their families for the sacrifices they have given for us and for the sacrifices that they continue to give. Life, limb, sometimes liberty. And I just want to say God bless them. God bless their families. God bless them. It takes a special man, a special human being to risk absolutely everything, to risk not seeing the sun tomorrow morning for other people who are there, they have never met. So God bless them. That was a beautiful song. And uh, for all of you downrange at the moment, Godspeed, come back home to us. It was a lovely, lovely song. So thank you guys for, for recommending this song. And uh, guys, I'll see you next time. You know, be sure to like and subscribe. Again, hit the notification bell and leave any comments. Um, any recommendations because more songs like this this is a great song it's an emotional song deep meaningful heartfelt and i think it's important that we get back to music that's just like this so thank you so much guys and i will see you again sorry to leave you on a somber note it's a somber song if i was here singing and dancing and being all happy it wouldn't be right thank you very much great respect to those men and women have a lovely day